California looked to regain its winning form coming off consecutive losses to UCLA and Oregon State. However, due to injuries, the team would have to do so without Deshaun Jackson, Robert Jordan, and Ryan O'Callaghan. After an early Cougar touchdown, Cal responded with a 39-yard touchdown run by Marshawn Lynch. He's in the 20, 15, 10, he's going to dive in, touchdown Bears! 39-yard touchdown run, Marshawn Lynch. It appeared one Coug had a chance on the angle, but Lynch was so fast he eliminated the angle for the score. On their next possession, Cal got into an offensive flow, starting with Justin Forsett's long run, followed by a touchdown pass to David Gray in the corner to take a 14-10 lead. Lynch to the left. Ayub looking downfield. He's got a man. It is caught. Touchdown, David Gray. Three men on the coverage, and he caught it anyhow. What a play by David Gray, the converted wide receiver, who showed that he's got the great hands Joe on Joe Ayub caught, moving the offense downfield with passes to Gray, Cunningham, and Hawkins. Ayu back to throw, stays in the pocket, throws across the middle, and is caught Cunningham. Back to throw Ayu, under some pressure, launches it down the left side, and another sensational catch by Hawkins. Not to be outdone, Cal defense scored with this Greg Van Hoosen touchdown, followed by a Tim Mixon interception, but all the way down to the three. Throws a interception again. Here's Tim down the direct side to Mixon. Mixon's down to the 10, to the 5. He's down to the 2-yard line, maybe the 1. It'll be first and goal for California as Brink of Destruction would be the proper song title. The Bears will it in. Right Joey, the Chris Mandarino in the corner of the end zone for another touchdown. He's going to throw. He rolls out to the right, looks into the end zone, and throws and caught. Touchdown, Bears! California led after the first half 28 to 10, but would surrender 28 straight points in the second half. However, the momentum shifted with this touchdown by Laurel Cunningham, five minutes left in the game. Down the middle, he's got a man, it's Cunningham, he breaks a tackle, and he is going to go the distance. 15, 10, 5, touchdown, California! 59 yards on the play, 57 make it. Cunningham comes up huge again, the following drive key first down which leads to the game-winning touchdown catch by Lavelle Hawkins. He's got Hawkins in the end zone for a touchdown, and California has regained the lead. Hawkins wide open in the end zone for a nine-yard touchdown, and the Bears take a 41-38. Washington State poses a serious comeback on the final drive, but Philip Mbaku and the stifling Cal defense made sure that the Cougars' dreams fell short. Near the sidelines, but it did take 10 seconds so the Cougars are, you know, maybe will get Todd three plays if they get a if they get a first down here on fourth and eleven. This could be it for the California defense. The ball game is on the line. Three wide receivers in the contest. Brink out of the shotgun. Three man rush for California. Brink back to pass. Looking, looking, flushed out of the pocket, but that will do it. California will win the football game. 15 seconds to play. Although it was close, California, California earned a comeback victory 42 to 38 and improved to a record of 6 and 2. Despite missing Jordan and Jackson, Hawkins and Cunningham filled in admirably, scoring the final two touchdowns for the Golden Bears. Offensively, the Bears had an outstanding game. Joe Abe threw for 274 yards and four scores. And on the ground, Marshawn Lynch ran for 160 yards and one touchdown. On another note, this was the first win against Washington State since 1998. Defensively, the Bears had a strong showing all around. Linebacker Ryan Foltz ended the game with eight tackles, and Tim Mixon finished the game with four tackles and one interception. The Bears finished the night with two interceptions, and the defensive line recorded four sacks on the night.